What's up, you Super Nintendo soldiers? It's Saturday. As you can see, it's a little bit lighter out than uh, my typical videos. I slept in this morning. Sleeping in means six o'clock, not five. As I leave you with that bit of information, I'm gonna lead to another, and it's gonna start off with a question. This question is very important. I want you to ask yourself this before you do anything that you do in your life. What are your intentions? In this culture, we're so quick to point the finger we're so quick to say this and that without understanding what a person's intentions are before we judge them for the things that they say or the things that they do. So what are your intentions? Are they pure? Are they whole? Or are they superficial? My intentions are pretty much the reason why I don't post my body on Instagram that much. This dog is pissed at me. As I was saying, my intention towards what I'm doing is really why I don't post many pictures of my body on Instagram is because I don't, I don't care for that type of attention. I have intentions, not a need for attention, which is a big problem that I find with what goes on in society. A lot of what we're doing is grabbing for attention. Let me judge this person because I know this tweet is going to get a lot of attention or let me post this scantily clad picture because I know it's going to give a lot of attention. What does attention do for you? Well, I wake up every morning and I post these videos with the intention of inspiring somebody who is in the situation just like me. When I first posted my body, I posted that picture with the intention to inspire somebody who looks just like me. The attention that came afterwards was something that was kind of damaging. People that pushed me to the side in the past started welcoming me in, which kind of inflated my ego. Ego is a good thing to have when you're attacking something. Ego is not a good thing to have when you're sitting around and being idle. Part of the reason why I started to head towards a field of work that needed an education, I needed to occupy my time. So I wouldn't be sitting around with an ego that was inflated and I wasn't doing anything with it. That's not something that I need in life. That's not something that anybody needs in life. And that's something that happens a lot when we're posting these pictures and these tweets that get so much engagement. Really, what are you doing? The whole idea of intention came to me yesterday when somebody asked me, oh, why, why can't I find a relationship? You can't find a relationship because your intention is finding a relationship. This, that's something that should happen naturally. Love should happen naturally. You shouldn't want for it. It's normal to have feelings of loneliness. Part of the reason why I started this daily vlog is because, hey, I'm working towards my goal. I'm striving towards my goal. The people in my life didn't want to hear about it. There's people out there that do, though. And, uh, you know, I get messages and I hear about that all the time. I'm not on here to rub in anybody's face what I look like now. I'm not on here to get up and tell you, hey, you're a lazy sack. You didn't wake up this morning and go running. That's not my intention. My intention is to tell you, if you have a goal, you have to work for it. Every day. You have to work for it. You have to get up and go. That's my intention, is to get people to move and strive for their goals. I think that's a pretty neat thing. But hey, who am I? If you click the link below in the description and make a donation to the Healing Meals Foundation that I'm fundraising for for this Hartford Half Marathon, I'm gonna give you a shout out on all my pages and I'm gonna send you a recipe for a well-balanced meal that'll get your meal plan kicked off right and get you headed in the right direction of health and wellness because that's what we do here. We spread the we spread the health. That's the bump fit motto. Once again, I'd like to say thank you for joining me this morning on my warm-up walk. It's Saturday, which is the long run day. I'm about to get this eight miles in. I'm gonna take it back from 10. Next week, pick it back up to 10. Nice little break in training on the long run. So your body deserves to be worked around. It doesn't have to go bang, bang, bang. You gotta give it a little bing, bong, bing. It's nice to play pinball with yourself. So hey, all love.